In the fair world, the sound should have been bigger than U2 and more influential than Joy Division. I mean, they had it all. They had intellectualism, intellectual depth, and a very poppy sound. People should have loved them. Music critics did, at least for a while. But then they never really gathered a big enough following. Was that a typical case of bad luck? Or was there something more, where they're just not weird enough, not poppy enough, not angry enough, not romantic or depressed enough, simply not enough of something? I listened to From the Lion's Mouth, their second album from 1981, and I can somehow understand. Most songs are mid-tempo vehicles for Adrian Borland's voice and his lyrics. The lyrics that actually bounce back and forth between cautious optimism and an et almost eternal history of failure. But then it still hits me. It's a clever album. It turns you upside down, turns you inside out. Best examples, winning, a surprise victory lap for losers, New Dark Age, perhaps the best doomsday anthem ever created, and Judgment, a song so restrained it practically unfolds in front of you. And if you listen closely enough, you'll see diamonds all everywhere on the album, diamonds that are just waiting for a bit of light to shine. 